Hey folks, this is Noble Rambler, and welcome back to RimWorld. I'm watching David here trying to convince Purple to join us. I hope it happens. Oh, failed. 0.7% chance. It is so slight. I need to get Klaus in here to do his magic. Actually, there was a time many episodes ago when we were out there on the world map and we were doing our caravan that I stopped and didn't record. I just hit an old save and went off to experiment with the world map to see how things worked over there. And that time, when it wasn't real, and it wasn't being recorded, it wasn't even you know part of the series, David actually convinced Purple he became part of the colony. Now that, we're, now that it's real, I can't get anybody to convince them. Um, it's midnight, you well, know, one in the morning, and most everybody was out doing things and they're all heading to bed right now i normally would have just recorded this or i would continue playing this until like seven or eight in the morning and then started recording but we are running out of animals really fast there's very few left out here what's sleeping has stayed well, everything else is pretty much left we've got to come out here probably before dawn and get all that we can get so i thought i better get the recording going i did send folks into here very gingerly and got all of the squirrel bodies out of our gauntlets so that the pigs can haul them all in so that's good i did get david in here to load a bunch of materials in where are you at right now you're attempting to recruit may may now okay um when you're done with that your food is fine why don't you come out and get some of these built let's just work on all of these i see it sending you all over the map to go get wood hmm yeah we're just firing all back and forth we'll see what that actually turns into it'd be nice to get the wooden ones finished around the perimeter that i had set um these turrets are live normally these are off that's all back to normal after our great squirrel oh, boy what do you call that <laughs> it, it's something that i wasn't expecting let's put it that way eric is healed and he is the last one so everybody has gone through here, got through their bites, no infections, and it's worked out well. Tomislav's up already, because he was pretty much already in, in good shape. You are consuming a fine meal, then let's get you to do some cleaning right afterwards. Let's let Handy sleep a little bit more. Um, Rabbit hasn't made it to bed yet. Where is his bed? Is he in this area still? He's not. Where did I... I put Rabbit down. Oh, he is right there. Okay. He's there. Michael's there. Catherine's there. Shantigo's there. So it looks like the day crowd has, for the most part, made it to bed. Michael will have just gotten there, too. Miss P, you are making kibble up in here. You did. How's your food? You're good. So we don't have a lot of meat left. We can do fine without meat. We can eat simple meals. The animals need the kibble, which requires meat. And that's our problem. We've got a week until uh, spring hits. Seven days. And unless we get some kind of a migratory herd coming through, we're uh, going to be hurting badly on meat, which means I wonder if we do want to shut down our production of fine meals and just save the meat for kibble for a week. That might be smart. That might be smart. So let's rework that. We're, we're getting to, to dawn. I'm going to pause now. Let's suspend you and suspend the survival meals for now. Work on simple meals and let's go ahead and take these up another 25. We'll go to 50. We'll do a week of, of survival meals for a while. I'm, I'm simple meals for a while. So what do I want here? The 25 to 50. Okay. Let's go that route for now. They're, they're only going to want to eat the, the the fine meals at this point because it's the best thing for them. They'll automatically go there. Grandma, you're doing what right now? You're playing horseshoes. Okay. So, yeah, 5 in the morning. Let's take a quick tour through here before we let any more time go by. That alpha beaver is still here after all this time? You're kidding me. We have got to go get that. And you? That's been here for three days, too. I didn't think these were still here. Um... David, cancel that order. Can you just haul this one in for me? i got to get that under a roof and make use of that. Who else is out here that can do that that's a night shift? Sea Stars, why don't you race over here and grab this one for me and get that into the freezer. We can turn it into meat and 
at that transition it should reset all values to back to not spoiled or not even close to spoiled and reset the timers for us. So we have the one pig down there. We got the bear who's up now who's going to leave the map if he can't find any food. He's good for a while though. Pig is okay so we got a pig over here. So bear and a pig, an ostrich is out of food. He's going to leave. Fox, you're doable for a while. We could just snip at the at the rat and get that done. But I don't think there's a whole lot more. Um, there were a couple in this area. Hungry pig and a, and a full pig. And that is it. Seems like there's one last pig down at this end. Right there. Hungry. Yeah. Okay. We need to get over to that end and work our way in a circle back over to here. And then that's basically going to be all the meat that we have got access to. Let's see who is capable of it. Natalia is really close to her rest, so she's out. Um, how soon can I wake these guys up? Rabbit, you're wakeable. Dive in and go for a simple meal. We'll save the good ones. And Alicia, that's right, Alicia. <laughs> she popped out of her hospital bed a little while ago. She's one that got tangled up with that fox. She was in her white power armor gear looking like a little space soldier there and first thing she wanted to do when she got up go over and get a black version of her power armor so there's the white stormtrooper armor she went over to get the darth vader armor <laughs> yeah she's in she's in her little darth vader suit right now <laughs> um now let's go in order needs we're ready you are where right now you are sowing a strawberry plant because natalia has your research table okay that's fine so you're up in this area. Let's just, boy, roll call. I mean, just get you going. Or let's get the ones that don't need a meal over here. And we'll take out this pig. So draft and come on over. Uh, handy, you grab a meal and you go to the second shift. So go over to the other side. So you come and grab this meal. And then you're going to go out to, you're going to go low or high. Where are we headed first? First is right here. From the the uh, dining hall, easiest. Tell you what, you're just gonna go over here where David is, and you guys can all figure out your easiest path. Okay, rabbit. Same thing. Consuming a simple meal, good. Actually, let's do that in drafted mode, so I know where you're going. So you're kind of going to. It still has your line there. Interesting. Well, we'll continue that anyway. And then after that, you're heading out to that area too. Shantigo, you're in good shape. You just need food. So just get the whole crowd out there. One last major hunt. Uh, Got to remember to draft them right there. And then pop out to the those that need meals area. Klaus, same thing. And none of these folks, they've all got full bars from that wedding. It's still, it's still in there on, on all of them. So don't need to waste our, our, you know, fine meals, which is really just a plus five is what that means. Consume that and race over to here. Does anybody not need a meal? Same thing. Sangria, you're down there with Klaus. So you can go with him. Okay. So draft, come over, grab, and go here. All right, Cathra, a little worse shape, but still you, you're you good enough to, to work with this. Though you are not as maxed out as the rest. Why don't you grab a uh, fine meal instead? Draft and do it. And then zoom out and click. Okay. Natalia, your rest is not going to let you do it. Michael, you're maxed out, but you need food. Cooking a simple meal. Oh, you haven't got there yet, though. Good. And you're actually hurting a little bit, too. So you come on over and grab a, a draft and grab a fine meal. And then bring yourself on over to here. Now, Miss P, you're a night shift, but you must have got up really late because your rest is good. And your food is good. You're making kibble. We did get quite a bit made for the room, so we're good. We're, we're, we're viable again. And you've got a pile backed up over here. You're right there dropping off. Let's let you finish that and then go straight out to... Is this where I sent Tomislav? I think it is. Mm, how do I do that, though? Because I can't draft you and have you do that. But you're so close to making this. 
Well, we're just going to leave it there. Yep. Draft you. Come on out. Let's get this happening. Alicia, you are in great shape. Let's leave that fine meal and take this one instead. So actually draft and consume that. And then come on out to this side right there. Who's next? Eric. Just finished his hospital stay. His food could be topped off. And he's melee, so which doesn't really do us any good here. So I'm going to let you do what you would naturally be doing. There's a lot of repairs to do. You're good at it. And there are traps to reset. There are. Repairing a granite wall. You're right here already. Hmm. Got all the animals out of there. Let's get you on trap reset duty. So you're going to... Uh, you're repairing inside of this area. Okay. I did put all this back into the uh, the home zones. Though I did send... You now this needs it right here. Let's let him do more repairs before we set traps. David. Kind of the same thing and you're up. And I assigned you to go and get that, that one animal over there. Okay. In fact, who else did I assign? That was Sea Stars, right? Yeah. Grabbing the Ibex. Okay. So, otherwise, she is a, a sword. So, she's not going to be able to help us either. Grandma, you are playing horseshoes. You're in great shape. You don't even need a meal. Why don't you come over here and help Tomislav? And uh, draft and go over here. Tomislav and... Who was it? Miss B? Yeah, Miss B. So, Sea Stars, Kaya, you are in great shape. You're ready. You just need food. And let's have you grab a... I think a simple meal will be fine. I think so. Draft and simple meal. And then you're heading off to David Land, right over there. And then Faith does not fight, so she won't be able to hunt. Okay, so she's got her own list of things to do when she gets up normally. And I think we're good. So let's get the three out over here, take care of the one pig, and I think that is it for them to do. Uh, pause. Those Zs are really convenient to have access to right now. To find animals that I may not have seen. Even little ones. Nothing. This whole side is empty. Okay, getting up into here, we've got three. Right in there. They're still sleeping. Down in here, I think there was a... There's a rabbit. There's a hare over there. Okay. Yep, it's getting tight. Okay. Tomasov, Grandma and Speed, they're all on their way. Alright. Let's try that again. Nope. Just going to call you guys various. Let's go to here. And I'm thinking we've got an assault and two revolvers. Sounds about right. Alright. Hopefully it's enough to take a pig down before he goes berserk on us and Sends all three of us to the hospital. <laughs> At least next to each other. Something I was working through with the squirrels. If we can't hurt each other if we're next to each other, does that include with a squirrel running around our feet, shooting at it? Can we still not hurt each other? So I could have kind of let them, but just the risk of getting bit over and over again, but they could have taken them out. All right, let's see what you guys can do here. Got him. And he's getting away. Ooh. Okay, let's go a little closer. There's a tree having a little dance right over there. And fire. Nope. Still too far away. Oh, got him. Good. Alright, you're doing that. And then you guys are finding a way to get over to here. Handy, what is there for you to start with? That doesn't fight back. Got this hair. Why don't you run over here and take this one down? He's going to immediately go behind a tree, though, isn't he? Fire at. Oh, ran the wrong way. Okay, good. And not forbidden. There was one more over here. No one else has made it. Well, these guys are all definitely on their way. Yep, here comes the here comes the pack. Okay, let's get closer to that other hair I just saw. Where was that? Now the trick is I got to go back and find all these things later to uh, pick them all up. Do we go after the few boom rats that are left? I don't know. From here, that's good. <laughs> well, that'll get you over here, I guess. 
Andy's just got to do her thing before they all start standing there. Now, come on down over here now. And fire out. Oh, Alicia did get into range. Okay, then let's just jump back into place. Who else is on their way? So we've got Sangria and Klaus on their way. Eric is staying. Are we coming in from down below? No. And we got the three over here. I guess that is the crowd. Okay, you guys head over here. And the rest of you, come on over. We're going to make a great big production to take down this hair. Yep. Mm-hmm. <laughs> That's one important hair there. All right. Take him down. Thank you. And do it again. All right. Unforbid. The group that is here now. Well, let's do the whole, the whole shebang. We're headed where now? We're heading north. Got a pig. We're heading here. That should let the other ones catch up to us. Now, if I can keep it at 9, you see a 3x3 three three pattern there. Makes it really easy to sort them out. 10, 11, and 12 become 4 deep. It always seems to go north-south. So if I can get... If I can stay, say, here, they will not, you know, on the side, then 4 deep isn't a problem. They'll never shoot each other. Theoretically. That's why we got a pack of hunters. You can revolt all you want, and we still live through it. Who's left? Tomislav, Grandma, and Miss P. You guys, that's three of you? I believe so. We haven't got any of these guys. You guys go further in and meet us there. Got a hair over there, but I want to get up to the big things. So we're going north. Nothing in here. Nothing winding through all of this. So I believe we're heading to the bear who's heading to the border. You guys head to here. Meet us there. The rest of you, we need to take that bear down in one hail of bullets. You're near the border. You're heading north. There's a pig and a rabbit over there. Our pigs that go out and haul all these things in have been busy the last week moving all of the food out of the old freezer. So now that that job is done, we should see... There's the last group there. We should see them being able to get further out into the, the map and doing things again. So it's possible they're going to find a lot of these animals and pick them up naturally. All right, there's a crowd. There's a bear. How do we handle the bear? I think we do it with every single gun we have available. Let's wait just a little bit longer. Tomislav, you're over here. Can we go after anything else while we're waiting? Let's actually let's go just a little bit further north and take out this fox. Um, there. We'll see where he goes. Who else is coming? It's these two over here. Send you guys up into this area somewhere. All right. So with everybody here, let's go a little bit further. Give us a little room. He's definitely going to charge us. Let's see what happens. Okay. First hit somebody. Headshot. At least he fled. He didn't go after us. Okay, and you're done. All right, that crowd is there. Let's go further north again and do the same thing to a raccoon. Actually, let's go a little bit further this way. Right there. Perfect. And fire. Okay, you're done. Now that everybody's here. <laughs> Come over here. Let's see what we can do with a grizzly. Can I get not four deep? I can't. It's going to give me four deep no matter what. Okay, who's in the back? Kathra, you go to the front. And we're ready. Oh, I don't know about that. Hmm. I want a little more room. A little more room. If he charges us... So, okay. That means that the pistols may not reach. But everybody else. So let's go with attack. So that nobody will run up there. So if they can't quite reach, then as he charges us, they will then automatically fire. So we'll go with that. And this is where I need to hit save, right? There isn't a quick save on this one. Skyrim, you'd hit F5 over and over. That didn't work. Why didn't that work? You guys there? What's happening? You guys? No. Oh. What is... That's really weird. Fire at will. I can't... Rec Nobody can reach it? Okay, what just happened here? 
Have I just gone brain dead or something? You're doing that. Um, can Alicia go here out of range? Okay, that is definitely a out of range. You're kidding me. Doesn't look right like it's out of range. Okay, well, we'll do something like that. Miss Peep, back there. Now can we attack? Some of them can, but it's going to work. Okay, that was strange. I must have been 32 away. Okay, guys. There you go. That's what I'm talking about. Michael, go. <laughs> um, Michael. There. All right, you're down. That sounded a little bit like Chewy there at the end. Hmm. Raccoon, bear. Was there one pig over here? There's a rat. I think we're done over here. Let's let it run for it. There's a pig. Yeah, let's let's go for it. We have one or two more pigs off to the right, and that is the last of the animals on the map. So let's take advantage of what we can. You are going to make this so hard on us. All right, right up in there. That'll do. And right there. And actually, is there any problem with doing that? Nope, I don't think there is. Guys, nail them. Thank you. Okay, off over here. Then I'm going to have to let some of you get back to bed because I pulled you out early. One, two, three. I think that is the end of our supply of meat in the whole wide rim world. Except for maybe a rat or a hare left. All right. Um, nothing is still sitting forbidden. That was there. And that guy. Raccoon. Fox. Yep, that's it. Who's down below still? Okay. There. Faith. And animal dogs are doing their thing. We've got a turkey over here. Okay, we'll go after that turkey, or at least we'll send we'll send Eric after that turkey. What could possibly go wrong? You've got actually sea stars with that blade. We haven't really tested that yet. Hmm, where are you at? You are down here. You're consuming a fine meal. Needs when you're done with your fine meal. Hmm. Then okay, let's draft and grab a regular meal. Right? Needs. Now we'll go for a fine meal. And then come out here and take on this turkey with this, the Plasteel Gladius, which should be more deadly than Eric's club, I think. I think the club was a 5 point something melee damage per second, and her Gladius was a an 8 point something. So we're just waiting for a more effective club to be available. Right there... I'm thinking Shantigo is kind of in the back in this assortment. Tomislav, you're up in there. That should put us in a safe configuration. Let's start with that one. And let's go for this one. Nobody can reach. Okay, go over there. Don't you run off the map. Go over here. Right like that. That gives us Handy up in there. And a Sangria down in here. We happy? Nope, Sangria right there. Now we're happy. Oh, you went to go eat. No, 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 no. All right, no, 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 no. How much did you eat anyway? You didn't get it. Okay. Are we done? I think we're done. I think so. So let's just release and watch. Look at all the lines. Okay. So, break a little bit handy. Let's go with needs. You are starving. You're consuming a prepackaged survival meal that you have on you. Yep, that you have on you. Grandma, you resting, but you can haul this one in on your way. And over here, we got Tomislav researching, so you can haul that one in on your way. Okay, of the rest of you, we have a Klaus. Your food is fine. You can haul this one in. 
And working our way through. Michael will not do either. Um, you just go do your thing. Sangria, you can race over and pick up. There was a second one over here. Um, right there. You can haul that one in. And Miss a P. Yep, you can bring in... Why don't you bring in the bear? You can haul in Mr. Grizzly. And who else is over here? Kaya. What was left over on this side? That We had the pig over here. So you haul this one in. I need some of you to go low. We have two waiting for us down below. Shantigo, you are in decent shape still. We had nothing around this maze. The first one was right there. You haul that one in. Then there's something else... No, there wasn't something else. Uh, there were two rabbits. That's right. There's two rabbits hiding down in there. Who is that? That is Alicia. And head down into... There's a rat. There's a rabbit. Maybe we never got the second rabbit. There's the first rabbit. Hold that one. And... What are you? An emu, along with another rabbit. We need the emu. Hmm... That sounds like Michael who won't haul. So let's do all that. Okay, of this group, Kathra and Michael and Rabbit, Mississippi, Alicia, Shantigo, you three have been assigned to do other things. So you guys come out over here, and whoever was going to haul this one in can help out. So you guys go to here. Oh, draft, and come over here. Okay, you're going to do that. Who's the one that was coming after the other one? Think of both of these two. Let's grab both of you. You're both headed into this area. Okay, so you guys draft and come on over here as well. The five of you can take down that emu, and then you can bring the rest of the stuff in. We still have the one, two rabbits over here. Oh, hello. So, hunt all of you. Five. There's five little critters over here. All right, so this group. Emu went there. Come on down into this area. Anything else showing up? Now, I'm, I'm making a guess on some things I've read. Something about, you know, RimWorld will allow only so many creatures within a certain space. So if you take out more, then more are available to migrate in or something like that. Let's, that going to do it? I think that's going to do it. So maybe now that we've cleared the map, more will come in to take their places. Be nice if it was a herd of something, but it could well be a. Uh, there we go. One down over here. It could be some kind of a. You know, just a whole bunch of little animals taking their places. More rats showing up or something. Um, yeah, something like that. Okay, you're done. Now, you guys undraft. Kathra, you haul. Rabbit, you haul. Alicia, you run up in here. And haul. Oops. Haul. And Shantigo. Head over here. And haul. And Michael, what's the chance? How you doing? You're okay. Let's have you hunt something. Let's have you bring in something. And that'll be your way of hauling. What was over here that... What would have the most meat of what's over here? Probably just a rabbit. Rat... Rabbit, rabbit. Okay, hunt this rabbit. Mm, I'm on you? I am. There we go, hunt here. All right, so that should do the job. The first job of the day. Oh, oh, oh. We've got a battle going on here. We may have just won it, too. Combat. So we've got Sea Stars gashed the turkey, Sea Stars slashed the turkey, and Sea Stars fainted. The turkey fainted, thanks to a cut. Okay, so with that, why don't you finish the job? Uh, didn't work. You were still resetting. There we go. Do that. Slashed and gashed and smashed and hit and died. Okay, you undraft. You, yeah, unforbid and all that great stuff and haul in the turkey. Okay, the great... Hunt, the end of 50, 5502. 5502, we've just finishing our third year here. This has been a really easy winter. It's still 
What is it outside? 42 degrees outside. That's been a really good winter for us. Good. We didn't have to fire up all the heaters in the base this time. What are we in some of the bedrooms, by the way? Hair revenge. Oh, Michael. <laughs> um, it's going to be so hard to hit him through all these rocks, too. Let's get you to a place that... Let's get you out over here. So that you've got a clear space. Oh, you finished them. Never mind. Hmm. And now I can't have you haul him in. I was going to give you a, a head start so you can shoot him as he's running towards you. But now you won't haul. Great. Um. Undraft. Um, yeah. Eat your meal. Great. And then if I were to have you... The chances of making that work are so small. Okay. Then we'll just have something else come out and get that one. You can eat your meal. And then you can hunt this one. And we'll see if we can make this work a little better. Where are the rest of the rabbits? There. There. Rat. Rat. Rabbit down here. Let's have you go after this one. That way, if he revenges, there's less chance that... The other ones nearby are going to join in. And we'll try that again. Um, who can go after that one? Don't know. Let's see who needs to go right back to bed and and uh, kind of recuperate. Tomislav's going to go back to researching. We're hauling wood in. Good. Eric is building marble tile. They really want to get these done. I think it has something to do with, with, prior, with, with age. These building projects have been waiting a long time to get finished. So they're, they want to head down here and do it. Um, health, you got a scar. Left shoulder. Doesn't tell me what it's from. I don't remember you having a scar before, so that may have been from something pretty recent. Probably an animal attack. But you're good for a while. Let's get you up into... If you're not automatically repairing, then all of these must have been finished. I'm thinking so. So let's have you reset, rearm this group over here. Maybe into there if we need to. Um, David is sleeping. Candy, have you made it in yet? You have. You're relaxing socially and you're good otherwise. So let's, well, now let's have you go down into here and get a bedroom going. We need to get some folks out of here and into here. I'm trying to figure out what our next priorities are. And I'm really kind of thinking it's this area. The beds are done. We've got an excellent, we've got an excellent. Um, we've got a superior table and a superior table. Let's have you, when you're done relaxing, build what? Kind of wondering about, wondering about just having you smoothing. I mean, you can go through it so fast. Handy. When you're done, let's smooth out this room here. Oh, let's try that again. So, relaxing socially. Smooth, smooth, smooth. There we go. The lower choice. You can plow through this one. I get someone else to do some uh, conduit work in the area and get the lights working. Steel we have. Wood we're, well, wood we have, we just got to haul it all in. That's a problem. It's all piled out over there. But I'm going to have you do this entire room just from smoothing. Oh, that's a lot of clicking. All right. Hopefully nothing happens and it voids half of those orders. Okay, you're going to do that. Rabbit. You are hauling in a hair, so the crowd is still on its way in. Sangri is dumb, she has so much training to do. Oh, she's using the telescope. Okay, heck with the animals. <laughs> um, oh, good. Got some, some wind power here. We, ooh, we've almost got this charged up again. Okay, the only thing I did was I just made sure these all had fuel. But it's just that random chance of when a, uh, um, when a, a solar... Oh, Hello, when the wind power is actually functioning. Nothing is blocked, no blocked, no blocked, and no blocked. Okay. Um, Catherine's coming in, consuming a fine meal. 
And we did suspend these, or we talked about suspending them. We did suspend all but simple meals. Okay, so we're going simple meals for a while. All the meat that's coming in is going to store. And a lot of it's going to be used for kibble. And as we get a little further into the beginning of spring, we'll release it to use as fine meals again if it's, if it's a doable thing. Bringing in the bear. Look at that big old thing hauling in. Kaya just crashed right there and watching the sun set. It's already nighttime? Wow. We left at dawn, thinking just going to make a quick run through. Yeah, time does funny things to you in this game. We have a, a muffalo named Emily. We did have a baby calf born. Calf number three, last episode. Saw a little pop-up come up while I was editing. So food-wise, we have wiped out all that kibble. Wow. Okay. Pause. Let's, let's get that assigned again. We're decent enough on meals. Well, we're hurting on meals, too. Need to get every cook working. Chantico. Playing horseshoes. Needs. You're actually really low on your on your needs because you all missed your 10 o'clock uh, recharge. 10 in the morning recharge. Um, Michael, you are capable. You're right on, you know, your forecast is right on the line, too. You're hunting that hare, and you need to come in and go to sleep. Okay, what was that last beep? I didn't really get a chance to read it. Who else can cook is what I'm thinking about. Faith, can you cook? Character, no. <laughs> Keep me away from that kitchen. Um, Kaya can some. And David, cook, not a chance. Eric, can. Who is in our night crew can? Let's go that route. Um, cooking, not too great. Miss P is decent. She's doing what, what right now? She's consuming a fine meal. And her needs, she's ready to go to bed. She's done. All right. And she's crashing hard if she doesn't get there. But that fine meal is going to help her out. Michael, hunting a hare. He's kind of stuck out there. He likes cooking, though. So cooking would do him some good. Let's go take a peek at Michael. You're bringing in your hair. Ah, good job. That's done. Then Natalia does not cook, right? Natalia cooking four. She's capable. She's heading for bed, though, right? Uh, needs. Nope, just heading for food, and then she's fine. So she's possible to get some kibble going for tonight. Kathra is going to bed. Sangria is going to bed. Uh, consuming prepackaged survival meal. Klaus is going to bed. Shantigo is going to be heading to bed here real soon so i think we are down to natalia let's get some butchering done which means kibble and rabbit bed handy bed tomasaw bed who was the other one kaya faith it was i don't know now eric night crew sea stars yeah you you went with us Oh, you went after the turkey, but it's like you missed your whole day of sleeping. Hmm, not good. Um, Grandma, where are you at? Grandma, why am I not seeing you here? There you are. I thought you were like right over here. My mind would not find you. You're rest. You are sleeping now. Hmm. Shantigo, let's get a round of it out of you. We'll go that route. And Kaya. Needs cook a skills cooking kind of. Hmm. Yeah, that's tough. We'll definitely get Grandma doing it through the night. Natalia will take over for the for this at the at night time. David, you Handy's still over here. David, bring the supplies for the the uh, conduit over here for me. Let's see if we can get some light in here. Klaus is attempting to recruit. I'll let you do that. In fact, let's get you to recruit and recruit and recruit needs. You're fine. you got to go to sleep soon, but... Nope. 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 They've all been done. Okay, so it's just a Mei, Mei Buffalo has given birth. I saw that. Oh, the wood's all coming in. Oh, good. Now the food has been hauled over from the other freezer. They can get back to other things like... All of this wood sitting out here. It's just been waiting and waiting. Oh, look at that. They're all bringing it in. That's great. We still don't have any food for them, though. Mmm. Yep. Yeah, meat's a problem. And Natalia. Michael, you're up. Great. Whose place can... Michael? Wait a minute. Needs? Okay. Then, whose place can you take? 
we have we have some kibble right there butchering that is shantigo shantigo you need to go to bed soon needs you're kind of there and you can start the your morning shift that much easier if you get to bed now so in that case michael let's have you take the place of shantigo and get some kibble going and you can bring a load of food up with you no you got to go all the way eh? what you doing Michael is butchering because there's not enough meat to pull it off. 19. Wouldn't you know it? One less. Yeah, Natalia's going to grab what she needs to get hers going. There's four. Okay, then grab 20 of something out of here. Okay, little by little. What time is it? Oh, 40 minutes or so. We're good for a while. Let's, let's see what else we can do. What would I normally be doing now that it's in the night? Tomislav, you can clean that up before you go to bed. Andy, you are smoothing needs. You need to go to sleep soon. So close. Hmm. Well, we got a lot of this done. David, you are attempting to recruit Decker. Klaus is asleep. Okay, I guess when you're done with that, come on back over and work on that light specifically. And back to Rabbit. You are resting. Anything to have you do on your way in? Don't think so. Nothing real critical. Your way in is clear over there, though. Anything that you could haul on your way in? Nothing is coming to mind. Although, this just came into my view. What do we have here? We have got a steel small sculpture, superior quality, made by Michael, called Blue Hugs. Beauty of 100. Art, what do we have here? On this work is an illustration of Tomislav disabling a wild boar with passionate rage. Two rams look on, probably thinking, oh man, we're next. A dead hamster sits behind the focal point. <laughs> he was first. Um, the image is totally devoid of both bliss and desolation. The portrait tells the story of Tomasov harming the wild boar on 14th of Jugast, 5502. Hmm. Who desperately needs a statue? That's a Tomasov statue, but Faith has got some issues in regard to her mood being clear up here. and She's already below it. I think it would be a smart idea to give her... She already got one in there. What's her beauty in this room? 0.6. Beauty. 0.1. Negative 1. Or 0 0.1. 1.2. .1. Doing pretty good for Alicia. Negative 0.3 for Sea Stars. But... And then Eric is a negative 0.3. But how are we doing? You're... You see, the, the lines are much further down for Eric. Sea Stars is doing okay... Alicia is already forecast to shoot up into there. David is way up in here. Faith is just floating on that edge all the time. So if she can spend eight hours getting her beauty maxed out a lot further, taking that bar up further as she sleeps, that's my theory there. Let's have her, let's have this go into here for now. Install. When we tear all this out, we're going to rethink where everything goes. But let's pop that into... Oh, right there next to the bed. Yeah, that, the hunting scene with dead hamsters. That ought to, <laughs> ought to do great to sleep next to. Um, and Rabbit, while you're coming in, though it does make you backtrack a lot. Is there anybody already down here before I let this thing start working again? Michael is busy. David is recruiting. He's on the other side. Kaya is where you're over here you're resting okay then let's get hmm your needs you're in i think you're you're gonna make it fine here let's do that how about you sneak over here and put this in i gotta do that from from here there go pop that in for me and rabbit in return you can come up here and clean part of kaya's room Make that a little bit nicer for her when she goes to bed. All right, so with that, what have we got going on? Kyle's busy. David is failed. Okay, so his next priority is to haul steel to a heater. Interesting. But let's have you to a heater. To a heater, to a heater. Heater right there. 
that's what you're up to. It already has this component, too. And that'll get heat, it'll get steel brought to this one, too. Okay, that works. Handy, it's probably time to let you go. A chunk of spacecraft has fallen from space and landed nearby. The game knows that we need components. Oh. 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 Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Oh! You are one lucky pig. <laughs> what are you doing? Oh, it's only 2200. I thought it was like middle of the night. Okay. Well, you're here. And set you to for deconstruct. And that'll get some base components for building our component bench, which is really close. Out of 3,000, we are at 2638. So if that thing continues to be researched, nobody's here right now. So Natalia will get into that. She might be able to finish it tonight. That would be nice. That was really close. Otherwise, there's wood over there. We're still sealed over here. Still need to finish this, but that's probably, realistically, a place for next year, next winter. That's not going to get done before we get into uh, to growing season again, I'm guessing. Um, do we ever get that kibble moved over? We did not. It is still sitting here and out of range of everybody. Okay, so Michael is heading that way. Natalia is heading that way. And I can't have, I can't e have either one haul. They, neither will haul for me, so I can't tell them to go move that kibble over so these guys can munch. Um, who to haul before I lose everybody to sleep tonight? Are we kind of out of... David is building. Okay, David, when you're done building that and building... You're attempting to recruit Klomster now. Build this one. And that turns on the lights. Okay, that room is almost habitable. David, I want you to... Haul this kibble right there. Consume, nope, haul the kibble. Then you'll automatically drop back into warden mode and take care of things. Okay, and maybe we'll finish it just the way we started with David in there recruiting somebody. It'd be nice to finish it with a with a recruit, a recruitment, but we'll see. So Grandma is cooking. Um, meals, we do kind of need it, but we have enough for breakfast. Let's get you reserved by Michael. Reserved by Natalia. You're much better at it than Natalia. And Michael probably needs to go to bed. So let's get your... Yeah, you're done. Let's get your last cycle of this finished. And then we'll have to have somebody else. David, boy, if you could just hold for a little bit longer. Thank you. Just, you know, just park yourself there. Michael's almost done. And I see I'm almost done, heading for 50 minutes. You, clear, go rest. Your food is going to be okay, David. Undo that and uh, haul 50 plus 25 kibble. Great, that's done. All right, Grandma. Really? I thought we had, like, meat galore hauling. We only have 18. So close, it takes 20. So, yeah, you're going to do some... Uh, some more uh, uh, butchering there. Well, with that, are we at a stopping point for this episode? Big, kind of a, you know, still a maintenance sort of episode. We didn't get these assigned. Hmm, maybe I'll try and get these before the next one, get David to pop up here. But well, I want him to go ahead and do a little bit of recruiting before. So, we'll, yeah, we'll finish here with the recruiting. So, getting ready to start furnishing this area. I want to get... I'm thinking these four rooms up and going. This fifth one. And then move on over into the, the jail. Get to work in the prison area. I think that's the plan. And then, yeah, we'll go ahead and tear this out. We'll make this whole thing a dining room. Just, I, really what I'm kind of waiting for is getting the research done so I can get the component table built and up and running. Then I know we've got the components to do all these little things that I've been waiting for. I don't want to burn up the last of our components and forget that we need a huge number to build that table. So we're shaking hands. We're happy. We're talking to purple. That's where we started. Let's see if we can we can uh, change our odds here a little bit. It's really a one in a hundred shot for him, but uh, it'd be nice if it would happen. Come on, David. Come on, David. You can do it. You can do it. You can do it. You're taking your time. 
failed. 0.76% chance. And with that, we'll call this one done. This has been Noble Rambler. Thanks for watching, guys, and we'll catch you later. Bye-bye.